I'm here now on the campus of Northwestern University in Evanston, Illinois, just north of Chicago. It's about 12 miles or so north of Chicago. Great location. If you get out towards the lake, it's the, the campus is right on Lake Michigan, and you can see downtown uh, from the campus. So it's another kind of these, one of these campuses like Tufts, like University of Chicago, where you feel very much like you're part of the city, but you're still enough outside of it that you can have this beautiful uh, tree-lined campus, green, especially now in the summer, probably not so green in the middle of winter. But there are a few things to know about Northwestern. Of course, I can't sort of in this short video tell you everything, but remember that, first of all, Northwestern is on the quarter system, so that means that you take uh, only three classes at a time in ten week, uh, is it three or four? Maybe four classes. Um, four classes a quarter in ten week quarters. So it's a little more intensive than at uh, some other places where you might take five or six classes over a fifteen week quarter. A um, couple of other things, there are about 8,000 students here, so it's a little larger than some other private universities um, of the kind, the caliber here, but it's not so large that it's a, a, a great big huge state university, sort of a, a nice size in between. This is a size that a lot of students are looking for that, that it's difficult to find. Um, the admissions office was telling us also that 97% of the classes have fewer than 100 students. That's an important figure to know. That's probably more important than the uh, student to faculty ratio, which is a seven to one. Ignore that, that statistic. It tells you absolutely nothing about the, the classroom experience, the, the percentage of classes that are uh, certain uh, enrollment or less, that's better. So 97% of, of the classes here are 100 students or less. However, uh, if the class is over 40, students, then there is a TA for the class that runs the discussion section as opposed to the professor. So uh, we were, um, our tour guide was from a, a double major, bachelors of music and performance at the Beaton School of Music. None of those classes are very large and so there were no TAs in that school. But then she also did, is doing a BA degree in history and about 50% of the classes that she had taken in history were over 40 students and therefore had TAs. Now, of course, it depends on the classes you pick. You might be able to, in history, to find a lot more classes that have a lower enrollment, if that's one of your priorities, to find those classes that have maybe 15 to 20 or maybe even fewer students, if that's a priority. But also remember that the more popular the class, the larger the enrollment, and the more likely you are to have a TA. So. There's a, there's a balance that is struck here at, at Northwestern that you have to decide if you, first of all, if you like having TAs, if you think that's a, 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 um, an opportunity or if that's an um, impediment to your education, that's something for you to decide. Obviously, the tour guide today was saying how important it was to have TAs, that they were really great, um, but other people would say, no, that's, a, that's not a good decision. That's your decision to make. Um, but uh, Northwestern, is a it's a huge campus a mile from south to north uh, plenty of walking it's in the summertime it's great it's, except you get a little hot but in the winter time it's going to be cold um, but then as she said the tour guide said you know in the summertime maybe this the summer is when you actually feel more oppressed by the weather because you just want to go into air conditioning whereas in the winter time you just bundle up you go you go ice skating you go walking along the lake um, nobody's uh, this, the student life is not impeded by the weather. So Northwestern, great experience. I'm really glad I came here. Uh, great education, difficult to get into. It's, it does, um, it's academically very competitive. About 18% of the students who apply get in. But uh, a great university in a great location, very close to one of the premier cities in America.